Good morning from the Evans household. We have a girl playing with her toys and a cat who's upset because I turned off his TV. They're watching Baby Animals in the Wild. And Simon is obsessed with watching this show. Yeah, I know. I turned it off. I know. And our house is a disaster. Just ignore the mess over there and the mess over there. But... Anyways, I hope you guys are all having a good morning, and I better turn on the show so Simon can get back to watching his baby animal. Oh, I was just going to say it's a little dark in here, but they just turned the lights on. We just finished seeing the Jurassic World Part 2, I think Fallen Kingdom or whatever it's called. So, what did you think of it? I enjoyed it. It's good. Now don't ruin it for anybody that may have not seen it yet. I thought it was good too. It was different than what I thought it was going to be. Mm -hmm. Like the storyline. Yep, it but, was. But it was definitely still good. Um, they definitely set it up for a part three, which I looked up is coming in 2021. So, um, I know my friend Lisa in the UK says that they recorded or um, filmed uh, this one, and I think the first Jurassic World, not far from their house in the UK. So it'll be interesting to see if they film the third one. So it's sort of cool to watch her vlog when they went walking around there to explore it. So um, I'll have to ask her and see. But any other thoughts? Uh, not, not right now, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I suppose we should go and get home um, to let the babysitter off and get back to our sweet girl. So we're just leaving the theater. It used to be called Waringburg, but Mar Marcus just bought it out. It's both of them are a good brand. I feel like I'm always recording in the car, probably because I forget to re uh, record. We went and saw it in, saw it in the IMAX, and um, this is just I'll record some scenery here as I'm talking. So, we're on our way home. It looks like it's going to storm, which makes sense because the heat and humidity have been outrageous here. And usually that produces a storm. And so, um, so yeah, going back to recording in the car. I feel like I'm always recording in the car because I've, I'm still trying to get used to the whole vlogging and everything. And then also trying to get used to the vlogging in front of other people. And not like Ryan but like people in general because like people give me really weird stares which is okay but it's sort of hard to get used to also so um this morning we just sort of hung out around the house and played with maddie and then a sitter came to the house so ryan and i could go on a date and see the jurassic world movie because we're obviously not going to take our three-year-old to that now if you if you are someone who does take your three-year-old to that type of movie i don't mean any offense by that um, so anyways, I'm going to insert some photos of us playing with Maddie now. We're just continuing again on our way home. I don't think we really have much more planned for the day besides just hanging out with Maddie and hopefully um, not heading down to the basement because of any tornado warnings so we're just driving home here and um, yeah sorry this uh, vlog for today isn't too interesting um, hopefully I'll remember to pull up the camera more frequently and capture more interesting photos than just of me in the car blabbing Okay, so we're just back home. We refilled our drinks from the theater to bring home. Although I don't, I'm not sure why we do it because we hardly ever drink the refills, but that's okay. So I'm gonna, Ryan. I think you need to grab yours first. Oh, Ooh. that's okay. Just grab it from the. That's okay. Okay. The challenges, Ooh. first world problems. The challenges of trying to get two oh, super size, two super sized drinks out of a cup holder. <laughs> but anyways, we're gonna head into the house and then go see our little girl. So these two crazies are gonna go take a walk in 110 degree weather. Simon and I are gonna stay inside. I, there's no way I'm going out there. Hi, Maddie. Hi. Hey, Maddie. Are you gonna go on a walk with Dad? Yeah. Look at you. The first time in your new wagon. Look.
look at that. You lucky girl. Yeah. You look nice and comfy. Yeah. Look at you in your wagon. Yeah. That's going to be so awesome. Hi. You have lots of fun, baby, okay? Good. Okay, you guys enjoy your walk. Yeah, yep. Simon, stay. No, stay. Come on. You you can't go on a walk too. You stay here with me. He's like, but I can I fit I'll fit in there. No, you stay in here. No, stay. Okay, Mark, can you get the door? Yep, I will. Bye, baby. Have fun. Enjoy the. It's actually cooled off. It's not too bad. I'll just pull it right on down. It it should go right on down. It's made for terrains. Hey, it's a twelve hundred dollar wagon. It should. It should go down just fine. Okay, we go, ready? Boop. That's not uh, like clunk. See, that's that's what I'm concerned about. Oh, but I would I would tip it down like like that and have it go down on both wheels. Oh, okay, that works too. Look at you! Look at that! You got look at she's got her leg up on the other seat. You're so silly. Oh, that's okay. Okay. All right, Maddie, you have fun on your walk with Dad. Okay, we're gonna go down the starburst, okay it's actually not too bad. It's cool off out here, but I'm still not it's going. Humid, I'm I'm still not going on a walk in this this nastiness. Yeah, no, that's fine. Okay, bye. Have fun. Enjoy enjoy the weigh in. Yeah. It'll be fun to test it out. Her first time. Yep. I'm having fun watching her in that wagon. Oh, I'm so glad I got that wagon. That's like the perfect wagon. That's like the absolute perfect wagon. Yep. Bye. And she's off. We've had that wagon put up and put together for, I don't know, a month, six weeks. But the weather's been so nasty out, we haven't been able to use it yet. And so, um, it was a big purchase, but we thought it would be a good purchase for Maddie. And so, Ryan's the first day testing it out with her. They have all these no parking signs. You see all those sticks, that white thing down in the distance, like right there there because they're going to come and re-gravel the road. I don't know when. Maybe after the 4th of July or something. But they're all over in our neighborhood. So, and they're off. Since we're out here, this is sort of my landscaping. I guess I'll walk in the grass. Ignore our tall grass. We've got to mow it. But, um, our landscaping. We usually put a flag out there. But um, <clears throat> we'll probably have to replant stuff because the stuff has just gotten so massive and so big. And then, oh, just can't. We've replanted this bush so many times and it just dies every year. It's the same one as that. And it just, pfft. but you know, now that these ones have gotten bigger right there. Oh, sorry, I should probably turn the camera. I don't know if I really like them. Or I like them, but I don't know if they really go. So I'm contemplating taking all three of them out and just putting more of these same um, hostas and whatever this yellow one is in. I don't know. We'll see, but that'll be a next summer project. And then along the house, we just have rock because we are definitely not gardeners. So anyways... <clears throat> That is that, and we I like having a little flag thing here too. We uh, usually change it up for like the holidays and different seasons and um, such like that. So that's the one we have right now. And I have a little cat statue up here, and everybody thinks it's a real cat. Sometimes I've, when we have our um, blind open up there, I have to do a double take because I am like, wait, is that a real cat? And I'm like, no, it's not a real cat. But and then just like. The spot to sit, to read to Maddie if we want to. And then we just... 
are back in the house. Woo! Feels cold in here after being outside because it's so hot and humid. But I wonder where Simon went. Simon! Well, anyway. Oh, there you are. Hi! <laughs> yeah! I know Dad and Sissy are going on a walk. You and I are going to stay here. All right, go under the desk. So Maddie's in bed, and I'm just going to, it's about 9 p.m. I'm just going to pull out some, it's not much cauliflower, but a little bit of cauliflower, some broccoli, some carrots. I think I have a cucumber in here. Um, just to make up some fruits and veggies. Um, I have blueberries. And raspberries. Driscoll's the best brand to get. That's the only kind I'll get. Blueberries I'll get a different brand of. But of raspberries and strawberries, I will only get the Driscoll brand. They're from California. And absolutely, they are delicious. So anyways, I'm going to get this stuff together. And I hope you guys all have a good night.